yourself to be bisexual? No. Okay. In any event, uh, you did develop a sexual relationship with Leslie Wexner at some point in time. Is that true? No. He trusted me. I trusted him. And, and we started doing things. So. Do you consider yourself to be bisexual? For 30 years, the Wexner Foundation has been making leaders, the next generation of leaders of the Jewish community and the state of Israel. My dear Les, you have contributed so much to the future of the Jewish people. You have done this with a vision and a dream, a vision you shared with others, including my dear friend. Tell him if he wants to admit anything, he can, but it's a lie. It's no, a good friend of mine who is a woman says that she believes that Roy Cohn wants to, in effect, come out of the closet. In effect, come out of the closet. Come out of the closet. I do not have a... Where, Roy, do all these stories come from? Oh, it's from? a cinch, Mike. Take this set of facts. Bachelor, unmarried, middle-aged, well, young middle-aged. And, um... Uh, then all the stories go back to the McCarthy Shine day. Yeah. Shine was a bachelor too. We were both bachelors. So was McCarthy. Right, and so was McCarthy. And you have worked to strengthen the bonds between the Jewish community in North America and the state of Israel. This is an important task and a responsibility for all of us. So, to you, and everyone at the Wexner Foundation. We say thank you. Thank you for all you have done and continue to do. I wish you many more years, many more years of health, happiness, and success in your important work. Shalom. Shalom to all of you from Jerusalem.